Thank you for buying the JLM Valve Saver Kit. JLM Valve Saver Fluid has been officially tested by Germany's leading automotive university and shows that the JLM Valve Saver Fluid stopped further wear of the valves and valve seats. This box contains all the necessary items you need to install the kit. This video explains how easy it is to install the JLM Valve Saver Kit. Installing the JLM Reservoir Begin by mounting the JLM reservoir in a suitable place in the engine bay, away from extreme temperatures. Make sure the reservoir is mounted no higher than the valve saver inlet port to avoid siphoning. Mount the bracket and install the reservoir into the bracket, making sure the sight glass is visible and the adjuster screw is easily accessible. Do not fill the reservoir yet. For maximum performance, the inlet port for the JLM system should be 50 to 100 mm away from the butterfly valve toward the inlet manifold to ensure good mixing with the air fuel stream. Drill a 2 mm hole at the correct location and tap a thread using an M3 times 0.05 tap. Screw in the inlet port using a suitable sealant on the thread to eliminate vacuum leaks. Now connect the valve saver fluid hose to the reservoir from the inlet port. Do not fill the reservoir yet. Installing the LED indicator. Locate a suitable position on the car dashboard, drill the hole and mount the LED into the hole. Then feed the LED wires back through the firewall, connecting the red LED wire to power from ignition. Then connect the black LED wire to the black wire from the reservoir and connect the brown wire to earth. Before filling the reservoir with the JLM valve saver fluid, make sure that the LED indicator is working properly by turning on the ignition and waiting for the LED light to illuminate. Fill the reservoir with 400 ml of JLM valve saver fluid without overfilling. Don't forget to replace the filler cap. Now check that the LED warning light is off and place the JLM sticker over the LED. Setting the treat rate. Run the engine at idle speed and set the dose rate at 15 drops per minute by turning the adjuster screw clockwise to increase or anti-clockwise to decrease fluid flow. Then lock into place by tightening the locking screw. Next time you fill your fuel tank, note how many litres of fuel you've added. Then check the JLM reservoir to see that you've used the same amount of fluid in millilitres. So, if you added 20 litres of fuel, you should have used 20 millilitres of JLM valve saver fluid. If not, adjust the drip rate up or down accordingly. Check the drip rate for the next few times you fill up your tank to ensure the correct dosage. For best results, use only JLM valve saver fluid. If you have difficulty installing this kit, consult a qualified mechanic for advice or installation. Once again, thank you for buying the JLM valve saver kit. For more information on our products, please visit our website, jlmlubricants.com.